Well, hello everyone and welcome back to Software Inc. Season 2. We are in an interesting spot, I think. Um, Shadow Killer 4 Antivirus, if you remember from the last episode, um, if you haven't seen it, feel free to look in the description. There is a playlist link that will bring you to all the videos of the series. Um, yeah, in the last video we have a little bit of a conundrum with our antiviruses. I'll show you here. Um, we have two antiviruses coming out pretty close to each other. We have a September 2000 and we have a December 2000 from competing companies. Um, obviously all the companies are competing, but anyway. Um, the reason why I say that is because really we would release probably October, November, so we're going to be smack dab in the middle of two other major uh, antivirus releases. And because I really don't want to wait till like February of 2001. That's a really long time. Um, especially since we have two days per month. Um, wow. Unless, yeah. So I'm going to probably do a November release on this. I think that would work out really well for, um, I think it's going to work out well for the game. I don't want to like let it stretch way too crazy long. Um, we'll get our, our hype out there. We'll get the press releases out there. We'll do our thing. And we're good at it. I mean, we got 45 million in the bank. We're invested in a large number of companies as well so let's get this rocking and rolling let's see so yeah we're gonna let the bug fixing take place um marketing's doing well we have a we added a print job last episode for oh, it's already finished because we can print like a beast um yeah there was actually the finish up there um we did some more prints for Vapor OS 4. We were down to 50,000 copies left, uh, and we were actually really well. Vapor OS 4 still bringing in half a million a month. I mean, it's just rocking it. So, okay. Um, and our support jobs, we are crushing it. We have a December 2002 release of our smokescreen game. It's a first-person shooter. I think that'll be pretty cool. So let's see. <laughs> Yeah, office software is rocking and rolling. We have to get up to 40 um, for the code units on this one. We already surpassed the art, if I remember right. Art was an eight, eight, six. We're already a, a full unit of code over, but we have to get all the way up to 40. So it's going to take a little bit to get there. Not overly worried, but yeah. Um, hmm. Let that go. I haven't done any marketing, as you can see. Yeah, let's do some marketing on this. Um, press release, let the mass marketers rock and roll on it. They can take their time. I'm not overly rushed on it. It's going to take a little bit of time. Let's put up at five. How's that? There we go. Because these are all ours, so we're not going to lose reputation. If we did pick up another marketing, um, if we get a deal that comes in for marketing, we might pick that up just so we have that capability over here. Um, the mass marketing team is doing really well. We only have one shift, so we do have expansion capability there. Um, that's not too shabby. So if we go here over to the teams, as you can see, mass marketers is only just basically an eight to four shift for them. The gamers, I mean, we have 40 people on that team. And you can see the compatibility is pretty strong. Um, not as good as the daytime divas. They are absolutely crushing it, as well as dark ops. Those two teams are just off the hook good um yeah look at that dark ops 2 is literally at exactly 100 so the biggest thing to check is if that ever gets below um like really we want to go in here to the compatibility and figure out why some of these uh folks aren't super compatible um as you can see here actually wow our lead is actually one of the biggest issues from yeah our lead is the biggest issue Wow, team compatibility is that low? Ooh. It also has really high leadership skills. Like, I'm almost tempted to promote Marcia Tyler. Man. And get rid of this lead. Team compatibility is that low. I mean, look at what that would do. It would jump the compatibility to literally 150% if I got rid of the lead. 
Wow. Okay, yep, that's exactly what I'm going to do. I think we're going to take... Who's this? Laddie's Taylor as at home. Um, let's see if we can do some education. I wonder if the... Oh, no, lead right there. Perfect. Um, slam you all the way up to three months of lead. I want you to be fully maxed out on it. I do... Oh, I can't do lead and HR. Ooh, does Dalton have the HR as well? I might have to do six months of training for Gladys and get that team compatibility up because that's just crazy. I didn't realize it was that. That's what was affecting their compatibility so much. So, yep, let's do that. Let's get uh, education up. Gladys, you are going to uh, get a promotion here shortly. Wow. That is amazing. Oh, I, I, I just can't. Ooh, look at that satisfaction going crazy. <laughs> Good skill is high. Design skill, art skill, marketing skill. So that's the team. You can see it right there. Um, ooh. Okay. Well, Gladys, it'll be nice when you get back. Dalton, I apologize, but you are going to have to rock on. Um, oof, that's painful. Is it because you are horrible at everything else? I don't know. I don't know what's causing that effective, not the effectiveness, but incompatibility. That should be their traits, I would think. Yeah, look at that. Team compatibility is boom. I feel uncomfortable in my team. Uh, I bet. And you're the lead. Stubborn Anthropist. Whew. That's painful. I wonder if anybody else is like that. Who else has a low team rating? Like gamers. I wonder if there's one in here that's causing it. A tank. Like someone who's super... Low, maybe? Uh, the lowest is 124%. I mean, I don't know if I can complain with that. That's so good. The highest is 165. 49s, 124s. And the lead's not even the worst. Okay. Fair enough. We'll let it be. That one's odd that it's it seems so low. Um, is there anyone who is not affected? I wonder if this is part of it too. Ooh. Well, that's painful. Aaron Rivera, you're a programmer. Good skills are a hundred. Why is your effectiveness so low? You are super st oh, super stressed out. That's why your effectiveness is so yucky. Um, question is, do we get rid of you? Look at the rest of the team effectiveness. You are fifty percent. Let's test this. I apologize to do this to Sharon. But we are going to let you go, Sharon. Oop. I'm going to dismiss the worker. It should immediately drop another person back in because we have HR management on. Go. So someone else should drop in and start to get trained up again. Let's see if that fixes that issue. Um, let's close this. Let's go back to the management. Um, yeah, see, back to 39 already because they're going to immediately hire for the replacement um, without any issue. Dark Ops, Dark Ops 2. Oh, I look at these compatibilities. They are all jumping up now.
Who, who was it that was really, really high on that one? Midnight Fix? Who was that? There it is. Okay. Oh! Well, oh, you're out sick. Not good. So this one here, yeah, everyone was really, really high. No one was low on this is what the Dark Ops team? No midnight fix. Oh, it was gamers, that's what it was. Because we're getting um Gladys. Right? There's no. Oh, and you're doing fine, buddy. Right? There's some really low effectiveness on this team. Hmm. I don't know. We'll let this whole thing uh, play itself out and see what it's going to do. We'll let that ride. Anyway, well, a little bit of team management there. Um, kind of going through the, the different skills, see what it's going to do. Support. Uh, did we want? No, we didn't want support jobs. We want a marketing job is what we wanted. Okay, we're going to reject that one. Yeah. Really, really low on our price point, too. Reject that. That's fine. Go away. Okay. Oh, you know what we can do? Let's release that. Say yes. We get some followers. It doesn't ever hurt anything. Um, it sounds great. We're not known in the market, which we aren't because we haven't done any software. So, um, sure. Can't disagree with that. Bugs are going well. For October, November. Oh, wait a minute. If we're going to do a November release, we need to do the press build. Uh, we need to set a November release. Of 2000. One month, one day. Wow, I might have missed the bullet on this. We were doing all the uh, personnel maintenance. Um, hmm. Might not have done this right. Uh, bump this up to 10. I want to get that out. And we're going to do a market press build go. Okay. Let's let that rock and roll. Let's see what, what happens there. Okay. Okay. Uh, how are we doing revenue wise? I haven't looked here in a while. 2 million, 1.5, got a million, 600,000. Okay. Um, hmm, interesting. Yep, there's gonna be some education costs because we got rid of somebody. Um, that should reduce the uh, stress messaging we were getting down in the gamers team down here. They're always just stressed out all the time. Can't say I've seen that thing pop up anymore. And so that's not really the resolution for any company. Just I'm stressed out. You're gone. Go away. You're fired. I mean, that definitely wouldn't fly and. Of corporate America. Let's release that. Okay, Vapor One Two Three. Not well known in the market. It's cutting edge. They released. Did, did, did. No mention of release date. Um. Well, it's Vapor One Two Three. You're right. I don't have a release date yet because I'm not in beta phase yet. So. And oh, we have to wait till the end of the day, then we'll see all of our followers drop in for um, Shadow Killer 4. Oh, we should start printing. But I want to see how many followers come in on the first little hit. Um, even though I'll probably do my standard. Um, <gasps> print job. Except. It's done. <laughs> It'll pretty much be that quick. Um, design. I don't like doing the design, I think they're bugged. Um, so, or at least I don't I don't understand them I guess well enough. Um, if somebody does understand those well enough, like if just pausing it is all I need to do, then eh, okay. Just to let them sit paused forever. I mean, ew. Okay, uh, beta review of Shadow Killer Four. It's not well known in the market. They haven't really heard about it. Might be a new big hit with all its new features. Be out any moment. That is true. And let's do a print. Do a limit of 150,000. Okay. And blink, it's done. <laughs> oh, wow. In storage already is 114. Like, 
bang, done, like that fast. Crazy. I see how it was actually behind in its update. That's awesome. Anyway, that'll take care of that. We have another uh, half month. Yep, there we go. Print has completed. Uh, let's do a review of this again. I'll source it. Paper one, two, three. Hopefully we had an NDA signed with uh, this company. Uh, ooh, a 9-2? Good gravy. Um, okay, yeah, that's that's plenty. Thanks, guys. Promote. Say yes. Cool. That got in its beta phase, too. That's really nice. Oh, wow. Toon Cube is getting... Vaporbox is going down. Well, Vaporbox is going to jump back up. As soon as we release Smokescreen, because it's used by Smokescreen, so they're gonna need both softwares. Ooh, ooh, who's being? Oh, Kate, let's take a look at you. No, not educate. Details. Introvert and generous. Um, really nice, quiet. Love working. Really like working with my team. The computers work nice. You're at home now, so you were. Just barely leaving. Okay. Your effectiveness is really low because your stress is super high. Oh, did I mess that up because of the effectiveness that they were super stressed out? Oh. Did I fire someone without even thinking about that? It could have just been super stressed, which makes their effectiveness look really low. Even though their compatibility with the team was deep. Hmm. That might have been an oops on my part. I hope I didn't mess that up. I might have to go back and look at the uh, video and see. Hmm, that could have been me. Oh. Well, how are we doing on food? I haven't checked that in a while. Oh, look at these. Look at those trays. Unrefrigerated food sitting out. That just sounds so yummy. Mm. Hashtag yuck. <laughs> okay. Well, I think that's going to wrap up this video here. If you guys enjoyed this video, if you can hit that like button, that helps me huge. If you're new to the channel, I welcome you. It is always great to have new people to engage with in the videos, to drop comments, to interact with you guys, to give me suggestions of other games, things like that. I absolutely encourage, love them, enjoy it. Always great to do that. If you are so inclined to hit that sub button, I am humbled and appreciative for everyone who does that. Um, it is just amazing to see the channel grow and to see... Um, where it, where it takes us so um, if you hit that sub button make sure you hit that bell icon it's one of my biggest tips I do just because um, messaging um, for new videos can be um, kind of wonky sometimes but um, make sure you hit that bell icon change it to all so you know when any new video or series comes out on the channel that being said I thank you and we will see you in the next video